<sighs> Hi guys, I'm Darren. Um, joining me for core class today, uh, slightly different to the ones that I've been doing just recently. We're just going to have a little accumulator, so the format will go 30 seconds work, a tiny little rest, then add another exercise, so a minute's work, add a little rest, add another exercise, a minute and 30 and so on, tiny little rest at the end of them. And we'll do six exercises, we'll accumulate them up, and then we'll have a little bit in the middle where we're going to do a little bit of slow work, controlled work, flexion extension of the spine, a little bit of um, um, holds, and then we're going to work up the original exercises back up, but in the reverse order. Um, just um, as a little warm up, come with me. The, walk, the movements are going to be uh, sit up, so copy me. I'm going to do five of these. So the first movement for your 30 seconds will be a normal sit up like that. The second movement will be a strict mountain climber like this. So join in with me, guys. The next movement is a little bit more complicated. You put the hands on the belly button. We rotate the elbow to the floor like that. And then a toe touch crunch. So to the side, we're going to put the feet about half a hand's distance away from your hand and touch your heels. Uh, the planch, plank. So it's a plank position, hands turned out. And what we'll do, we'll lean forward on our toes, put our shoulders out. And if we're feeling strong, we're going to make rotation movement there and back. If not, we can just hold in that place, driving out through the shoulders. And the last one is a cycle crunch. So our cycle crunch is one of these guys. Yep. And we've all done their movements before. Accumulating them will be hard work. Like I say, that will be um, a total of about 10 minutes, a little bit in the middle, something different, and then we're gonna go back up the movements backwards. Nice and easy, guys. So, sit-ups to start, 30 seconds of work. Three, two, one, uh, let's go. We've got 30 seconds. I want you to try and work as hard as you can. We're gonna actually use a bit of speed. I know if you've joined me on my other classes, a lot of the time I'm saying slow down. Today, for this one, speed up. So we'll do 30 seconds, we'll have 10 seconds rest, and then we will go back into sit-ups and add the mountain climber, and so on and so forth. It might seem easy at the minute, trust me guys, this will hurt real bad. So we've got 10 seconds rest, and then we will do, um, 30 seconds of this up, 30 seconds of controlled mountain climbing. I've got my hat on because it's not that warm in here. Let's go. It might come off halfway through. I don't really want to scare you with that. So like I say, we've got 30 seconds here, working them ab muscles, control on the way down. So lower back goes into the floor first, but we're not being too picky. We're trying to use some flexion, uh, reflex, sorry, to get our way up. And then we're coming up into that mountain climber position. Hands face forward and the elbow touches the knee. We stay nice and strong. We're not trying to move fast here. So we are changing it to a more controlled version. Squeeze the knee, squeeze. And we're going to go for 30 seconds. So we've got another 10 seconds now. And then we'll have another rest. And then we're going to sit up mountain climber and the rotation. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and um, relax. You should feel that burning already. I do. I'm generally okay at abs. So if you focus on the form, you will see you'll get some pain. And that's what we're after. And um, let's go into sit-ups. So we throw ourselves up, touch your toes, touch the floor behind you. Nice and simple. We keep moving. Like I say, this hurts already. It's going to be a long half an hour but it's good for us, apparently. We've got another 15 seconds, sorry 10. Then we're back into the mountain climber, then we take it to them rotations, and then another 10 seconds rest. It's a very simple format, you can remember anywhere. So we're up into the mountain climber guys, knee to the elbow. If you can see my body doesn't dip, my bum doesn't rise up. I stay nice and tight, I squeeze my knee, into my elbow. If you feel like you can't reach, it's probably because your weight's too far back. Bring your weight forward and squeeze, then touch. Five seconds. And switch around. We're into that rotation for 30 seconds. So the hand goes on the belly button. Then we touch the floor, elbow to the floor. We're not doing this, guys. 
and we're not bobbing side to side, your hands go on the belly button, we lean back and we try to rotate around the spine and create some serious burn. We've got 15 seconds. Now that really hurts. If you're not hurting now already, you made out of some good stuff. Five seconds, three, two, carnage. 10 seconds rest. This is where that rest starts to feel like nothing. So we've got five seconds, sit up, mind climb, and rotate, and that crunch toe touch. So let's go. 30 seconds action. Try and find a pace you can keep moving at. Like I say, it does seem like it will be easier as you start out, but already you'll realise that it's actually a bit of a joke and the abs are on fire. Five seconds, and then we're into that mountain climber again. Four. Up, into the mountain climber, guys. So it's knee to the elbow. Like I say, if you feel like your weight isn't, if you feel like you can't get your knee to your elbow, it's because your weight's too far backwards. Bring your shoulders over your hands. Squeeze as hard as you can. We're going to 10 seconds. Woo! That is painful. Five seconds. Three, two, Ow. And we're into the rotation. Hands on the belly button. Twist and touch and twist and touch. Ow. So I don't put music on guys just so you can hear me properly. Put your own music on whatever it is that you like training to. Keep going. We've got 10 seconds. If you need to come out of it, come back into it. It's as much as you can. Touch, 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 touch. And we're down. Hand about half a uh, foot away from you. Um, heel and we keep the tension on and squeeze now this will be brutal we don't want to come out of it and lie down we stay in it and touch and touch squeeze touch 10 seconds I think I might cry 5 seconds 4 3 and ow so next round sit up mountain climb and rotate that touch and that planche press up so we've got 5 seconds we're moving back into it. Yeah, I should be on fire now, guys, because mine are. And three, two, one, let's go. Oh dear, now we're in trouble. 10 seconds in, 20 seconds to go. 10 seconds, guys. Let me that mountain climber. Whew. And we're up into the mountain climber. Like I say, keep your body weight forward, knee into your elbow. Squeeze, squeeze. Keep going, guys. Checking the old watch. 20 seconds. 15 seconds. It's nice and controlled. If you look at my body, it's not moving, okay? The resistance is coming from the fact that I'm staying still. Three seconds. Two. Have relax relax. We're into the rotation. Ha! Hands on the belly button. Touch the floor. Touch the floor. <laughs> wow. Just having a breather. Here you carry on, guys. If you're better than me, that's absolutely fine. I'm about that. Good to see people doing well. 15 seconds. Woo! Ha! Oh, my life. Ha. Five seconds. Three, two, and the toe touch. Feet there, tiny bit away. Reach and crunch. Oh, dear. Keep working, guys. Oh, yeah. Enjoying that now. 10 seconds done. The next exercise is that planche plank where we drive out the shoulders. We lift the abs up a little bit. We've got 10 seconds in this still, though. Let's keep going. Five, four, three, and we're up. So this one from the side on, hands go out to the side. We drive the shoulders up and we hold onto the tiptoes. And if we want to, we make some circles. Now you can see that my shoulders are coming forward with my hands, okay? That's where the pain's made, and that hurts a lot. I'm making circles, so from the front here, I'm going out to the side, leaning over. We don't want the bump to come down. Another five seconds, again, just like the mountain climbers, we stay nice and tight. Three, and relax. So the last one that we're adding, guys, is that the bicycle crunch. Generic exercise, but after that rotation, we can start feeling it. 
I'm into the sit-ups. Three, two, let's go. 30 seconds of this action. This one really is probably where you get the most uh, breather. Not that any of it's a breather. It feels pretty critical around about now. But this will be the one that takes a little bit of pressure off. Ah, we've got 10 seconds. Wow. Five, four, three, I can go into the mountain climber. I can tell I'm getting tired because I start sliding backwards. Keep going. I'm just talking so I don't have to do it. You keep going. Whew. Ten seconds. And into the twist. The rotate, sorry, the twist. It's not a dance. Hands on the belly button. We touch, 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 touch down, touch down, touch down. Big breath, and back in. If you need a breather, that's fine. That's why we don't do numbers, because everyone's different. We do time. In a class situation, it allows everybody to work hard. Three, two, uh -uh. and heels, reach. So don't let the shoulders come to the floor. It's a crunch, guys. Really reach and touch. Touch. Squeeze, squeeze. 15 seconds. Wow. And the plunge rotations. We're back up, we push the hand out to the side, we push out of our shoulders before we get up, and we rotate in circles. The movement is coming from my toes, essentially, which may sound a bit odd. I'll go one way, maybe a couple of reps. I'll go the other way. Now that hurts. Now let's have a little breathe. We've got 10 seconds, guys. Abs are on fire. We look, we rotate, we move. And relax. The last one is the cycle crunch. Everyone's done one of these. So nice and simple. We're here. Yeah. If you can do it where you don't touch your foot down to the floor, good for you. I can't. Whoa. 10 seconds, then we're having a little breather. And relax. Wow. Stretch these abs out a little bit, and then we're going into a little bit of something different. Oh yeah. So what we're gonna do, if you've done any of my classes before, before, we're going into a flexion extension of the spine. So flexion extension of the spine, pretty much the fundamental role of the abdominal muscles. I'm just gonna have a little drink, pass a bit of time. So I'm gonna teach you this. I'm gonna get close to the screen, unfortunately for you. And what we're looking at here, guys, is from the side, you're gonna, you're gonna roll down and extend and collapse and extend and collapse, okay? I put my hand there, it gives me a reference point to kind of collapse around, okay? I'm gonna do 30 seconds of that. Finger goes on there, roll back, okay? And extend and collapse. And extend, collapse, and extend. You see how my hips stay still? And the extending collapse is coming solely from the upper back. We've got five seconds. Three, two, and relax. We're gonna do three rounds of that, 30 seconds on, 20 seconds off, because that really, really hurts. So, like I say, basically we collapse and extend, collapse and extend, but we do it on an angle just to add some resistance. It's very difficult. So, if you get this straight away, you're doing really, really well. If you don't, you just fo focus on what I'm doing, try to listen to what I'm saying, and then keep having a go on it. So we're here, we collapse, we extend, collapse, extend, collapse, extend, collapse, extend, collapse, extend. Ten seconds. Um, relax, 20 seconds, we've got one more round. That should be torching your abs up real bad. It is mine, it's absolutely killing. So when we've done another round of this, we're going back into that accumulator. We start with the cycle, 30 seconds, rest 10 seconds, and then do cycle again, plant rotation, and work our way back up. Good for us, eh? And we're here, 
We collapse. We extend. We collapse. We extend. We collapse. We extend. Collapse. Extend. Collapse. Extend. Four. I've come out of it. Another ten seconds action. Ah, I'm really relaxed, guys. So, thirty seconds, and then we're going back up that accumulator. No problems. If you can understand these movements and make them hurt, the more you can. In that thirty seconds, you want to be failing. Okay. Don't try to do these exercises to a point of sort of where you're trying to get through them and do last the 30 seconds and give yourself a pat on the back. You want to be doing them so after 20 seconds, 10 seconds seems like the end of the world, okay? Hmm? Oh, 30 seconds, sorry, my bad. Let's go. Find a bit of time. We're in the cycle crunch then to, fit, to start with. So three, two, one, and we're up. We squeeze down, we rotate. Up. If it's too hard for you, just a little crunch. A little crunch. If it's too easy, can we keep the feet off the floor? Okay. We squeeze up. And down. Squeeze up. And down. We've got ten seconds. Whoa, five seconds. And relax. So we've got ten seconds break. We do 30 second cycle, 30 seconds of the planche rotation. This is going to get very difficult, very, very quickly. So three, two, one, let's go. We squeeze up, we squeeze down, we squeeze up, squeeze down, up. Ten seconds. Five seconds. And we're up into that plunge rotation. I think I was quiet then because it absolutely killed me. So from here, we just roll forward. Guys, if you can't do the rotation, just drive out your shoulders and hold the position, yeah? We don't want it up there and we don't want it down there. My movement is coming out of my shoulders as hard as I can. Leaning forward. That's what creates the pain. And a little bit of movement just helps to exaggerate it that little bit. Five seconds, and relax. Guys, if you're on burning up real bad now, then you're better than I am. Cycle, plant, to uh, crunch. Easy. Here we go. Three, two, one. And we crunch. Keep going guys, keep working. We've got 10 seconds, no problems. Squeeze across. And back up, we're into that plant rotation. If not, straight forward. We drive the shoulders out first, get onto our toes, and we hold there for 30 seconds, guys. If we can do the circles, small little shapes, that's fine. The key here is push out your shoulders, lean your weight forward. We're not here. Shoulders are forward of the hands, okay? Bum hasn't gone in the air really high. 10. 5. Oh dear. And we're down. We're on that crunch where you touch the back of the heels. This is carnage. Touch. 30 seconds. Don't let the shoulders touch down. Keep the tension on. Three more rounds after this. Doesn't sound like much, but it feels like much. Oh, keep going, just because I've collapsed. I'm only human. Ten seconds. Three, two, and ow. So, we've got cycle, plant rotation, toe touch, rotate. Oh, three, two, one. Let's go. 30 seconds. We crunch. We squeeze. We crunch. Squeeze. And crunch. Squeeze. Oh my life. Easy guys. 
15 seconds, come on. What are you messing about? Oh shit. Five. I'm out of there. Planch, come into the screen. Make sure I can see what you're up to. Push it out your shoulders. Push hard. Squeeze. Push up. Feel your shoulders. Lean forward. If we want to rotate, we rotate like this, guys. Okay? Off the toes. Maybe feel that way. Come and take a few the other way. Eight seconds, hold. Five. And relax. We're into the touch of the toe. So it's a tiny bit away from the heel and just reach to it and touch. Touch. Squeeze. Wow. There. <laughs> 15 seconds. Keep going. Ignore me. Wow. Five seconds. Two. And we are into the rotation. So the hands go on the belly button. We've got 30 seconds work here. That was me stalling again. Touch, 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 touch. Ow. Touch, 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 touch. Yeah, keep touching. Keep going. Here. Got ten, five seconds. Oh. And relax. Now I can't actually remember what we're up to. Mountain climbers next, yeah? I don't think we just did that round, but if we did, we have to do it again, because I can't remember. I'm getting old. So let's go. Got a cycle crunch. 30 seconds. Your abs should be toast, guys. Oh, keep working. Five seconds. And the plant rotations. Starting to enjoy it. You can see the finish line. And we push up, hold, lean forward. If you want to rotate, rotate. Push out. I'm going to stay still and try and perfect my form. Shoulders forward with my hands. Five seconds. And the heel touch. Woo! Scorch you. Touch. Touch. And touch. And touch. Don't let the shoulders touch the floor. Squeeze them up. Feel the burn. Or something like that. Ten seconds. <laughs> Three. Two, and um, we're up into that rotation. Hands go here. We touch down, touch down, touch down, touch down, touch down, touch down. Wow. Touch, 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 squeeze, rotate. Remember, it's not a bob. We don't shift our hands. I'm taking a break to explain things. 15 seconds, 10 seconds, sorry. Touch, touch. We're trying to rotate around the body. Twitch, touch, squeeze. Five. Four, and across the body mountain climbers. So we're here, and no, straight line mountain climbers. Touching knee to elbow, squeeze, yeah? From the side, my knee needs to touch my elbow. Squeeze them in, okay? We're not back here, miles away. Bring our weight forward, squeeze that knee into the elbow. Ten seconds, and then we've got one more round. Whoa, massive failure. And relax, We've got one more round, guys. Ten seconds into the last round. We we'll start with the cycle, we we'll move into the plant rotation. It's all downhill from there, guys, no problem. Three, two, one, go. Oh, easy work. Oh, keep moving. Just having a moment. You have to keep
Keep gliding through this, guys. Five seconds. Wow. Plant, I'm going to do a hold this time to get perfect form. My circle's definitely gone. We drive out the shoulders as hard as we can. We go onto the tiptoes, we lean forward. We hold for 30 seconds. Whatever music you got on, it needs to carry you through right now, guys. This is a moment where I feel like I shouldn't have had my hat on. Catch that. Could you try again? There's Siri. Yes. 10 seconds. Five seconds. Okay, five seconds and count. Oh. <laughs> um, <laughs> we're into the toe touch. <sighs> Squeeze. <sighs> 15 seconds, guys. This should be burning up real bad. Keep it coming. 10 seconds. Touch. Don't let your shoulders touch the floor. Keep moving. Five seconds. Three. And we're up. Into the rotation. So we sit tall, we lean back. Hands go here. We touch and touch and touch and touch and touch. touch. Hands stay on the belly button. Come out of it if you need to. Come back into it. Find the angle. Hands stay and touch. Rotate. Abs are in big trouble now. And we, we work. Five seconds. And we're up into the mountain climber. This should be slow, controlled, and very painful. Here, knee to elbow. Oh, ruthless, guys, keep moving. You've got 15 seconds of these, then we're into the sit ups. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze the knee into the elbow. Five seconds. And relax. 30 seconds of sit-ups. Let's go. This should be almost like a stretch. It should feel comfortable. It doesn't to me either. I know. Fifteen seconds guys. Five. And we roll over. We stretch them out. I'm just going to show you one last thing, guys. So while you're having that little stretch, just watch what I'm doing. Just something to work with. A bit of fun, really. From the side, you're going to put your hands just um, by your hip, and you're going to lift your legs. Okay? And you're going to do five reps. Yeah? And your abs should be absolutely blasted. So you take your legs out in front, your hands go just in front of your hips, to create that sense of balance, okay? And what we're gonna do, we stay tight in the core, push your hands into the floor, and lift them legs off the floor five times, okay? And relax. This time, we're gonna do two more rounds, that's it. It's just something for you to do on your own. We're gonna crunch the chest a tiny bit in as we lift the legs. So you sort of collapse, chest towards your knees. Okay, so watch, my hands are there, push down, squeeze, one, two, Three, four, five. Easy. This time to finish, we're just gonna hit 10 reps, guys. Like I say, something to try to think about, get control. It shows that small movements are effective and uh, nice and tight. You don't have to do it for very long. Three, two, one. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10 and relax we'll go back to stretching them abs out thank you very much guys um, that's the end of that I enjoyed it i hope you enjoyed it and if you did please share the class um, on any social media platform with your friends anyone that you feel might benefit from it and make sure you tune into the other classes throughout the week plenty to go up i think uh even if you go into a gym take your phone and do the class sometimes the atmosphere of being in a gym picks you up a level yeah I know in a lot of clubs there's not going to be classes, but there's no reason why you just can't immerse yourself in one of the online classes and just get on with it, guys, on your own. Yeah, take it to the gym floor and get it done. Okay, thank you very much.